Hello, everyone. I just came from the beach, and I'm thinking it would be really nice if I go home now and have a good rest. I really want to lie down on my bed. It seems like I hear some sounds. What is that? She looked at me. Is it me? But I don't look like that. Guys, these are my friends, but they all look somehow broken. Look at this. We need to quickly get to my roof. No one should reach me there. Let's quickly see what's happening down there. I don't understand what's happening here. These are my friends. Look at how they look. Okay, this is all a terrible dream. I need to wake up somehow and it's just my dream, but look at how they look. It's very scary. We need to come up with something to wake me up. What a horrible dream. I have to wake up somehow. I can't be in this dream. It's very dangerous. What to do? It seems it was indeed a terrible dream. Finally, I managed to wake up. What a horror. I've never had such nightmares. My head hurts a lot. Oh, there are my friends standing there. I need to go to them quickly and tell them what I dreamt. Hey, guys, what are you doing here? You are real. Of course we are real. Why are you asking such strange questions? What happened to guys, you? Guys, you won't believe it. I had a very scary dream where I came home and there I was. Only I was very scary and evil. And then I ran out of the house and there were my friends. Good thing it was just a dream. I wouldn't want to see such a scene. Yes, you're right, Ragatha. Thank goodness it was just a dream. By the way, did you see that Kane wants to organize something very grand and invites all his friends? No! What's going on there? Let's go quickly. I'll show you what's there. Today is a very important day for all of us. At least that's what Kane said. I think we should trust him. Everyone is already gathered there, look. We'll come to him now and we'll listen to Kane's speech. Something very strange is happening here. Are you sure he wants to share good news? Guys, today I gathered you to tell you that I found a way out and gathered you all to say goodbye. Because right now I will set up the door that leads from this world to your worlds and you can calmly return home. It's been a pleasure meeting all of you, but now that we're done with you, it's time to go home. We've been stuck here too long. Oh my gosh, guys, did you hear what he said? We will finally be able to get out of here. It's impossible. There's no way out. Today there will be a way out and now you will see it for yourselves. I will set up the door and you will all be able to leave from here. Look at it. This is it. This is the exit. Now you can leave from here if you want to, of course. This time it should work. Guys, what do you think about this? It's definitely a good idea. Yes, Pomni, today we should say goodbye. I really want to travel the whole world and eat real carrots, not virtual ones like here. I really miss home. Yes, I would also like to return to my world and leave this digital circus. Let's try it! I can't believe we're breaking up tonight, but I guess it's time for us to go our separate ways. I don't believe it. I finally get out of here. It's a very important moment. I don't believe it yet either. It seems today we will part ways. I think our digital friends should support us right now. Give a like, subscribe to the channel. Stop! Where did everyone go? There's no one here! This is very strange. I saw them here. They were standing next to us. Everything looks very strange. They seem to have already left the circus and we should hurry. What if this door disappears somewhere? You're probably next, Pomni. Go in first and we'll follow you. Guys, honestly, I'm very nervous. Even Kane left the circus and it was his home. Apparently, he was hiding something from us. It's all very suspicious and strange. Let me try to leave here now. What is happening here? What happened? I don't understand. It seems like it was another hallucination. What's happening to me lately? Is this all another dream? How did I end up on the roof of the lighthouse? It's good that Kane's laboratory is nearby. I can go to him for help. Lately, strange things have been happening in my head. Kane is running there. He left the circus. How strange it all is. It's just awful. This is impossible. Hey, Kane, I urgently need your help. Hello, what's going on with you? You look very tired. What do you mean you set up doors in front of us, left our world? How did you end up here? What is happening in the circus? I haven't gone anywhere. I don't understand what you're talking about. Everything is fine with you. Maybe you just got overheated in the sun and you should rest. I would listen to my advice. No, I didn't overheat. It's true. I saw you set up the door and leave for your world. Then we were left alone with the guys and they also started entering one by one. And then I ended up here. It all happened at the ceremony. You first talked to us, then left. Apparently these are just Kalfmo's tricks, and he cursed you. I always said there is no way out, and I couldn't be there. I've been in my laboratory all the time. This is terrible. I entered this door and appeared right on the roof of the lighthouse. Can you imagine? It's all very scary. How to solve this problem? I don't want to keep seeing things constantly. This is very strange. By the way, I had a very strange dream today where I entered my house and saw my copy standing there. Yes, it's another curse. You just need to drink a potion now and I'll probably throw one of my antidotes at you now. And you should feel better. 
I hope everything will be fine. Yes, let's try it quickly. I don't want to keep having nightmares. Hurry up! Throw it! Wait here requires concentration as long as you don't miss... I feel nothing. Nothing happened to you. I just lifted the curse from you and you won't have any nightmares anymore. You don't have to worry about it. Thank you so much. I'll probably go home then and you stay here and take care of your business. If it doesn't help, come to me again. We'll continue the treatment. Guys, you just can't imagine. I don't like all of this. It's all strange. Maybe my headache is starting just from the thought of the exit. I need to forget about this exit. Kane was right. There is no way out. I've been searching for it for several episodes in a row, but I haven't found anything. I guess I'll have to forget about this idea. Guys, I'm already at my home. Now we can relax a bit. Oh my gosh, what are you doing here, Kofmo? Why did you come here? Get out of my house immediately. Ha ha, Pomni. Hi, did you like your dreams? Why are you ruining my life again? What did I do to you? Stop doing this, it's not funny. I don't know about you, but it brings me a lot of pleasure. And messing with the exit is also my doing. You have nothing else to do. Return everything to how it was before it. I hope hey, what are you doing? Stop it! Why are you setting my house on fire? You. Guys, look at what he's doing, burning my house. Stop! You don't need to do this, please! What do I do now? Regatha, why haven't you mended your dress yet? It's all holes and patches. No more of this, Miss Pomni, I swear. Forgive me, Your Majesty. Girls, what are we gonna do today? I want us all to go to the pool today and splash around in the cool water. What do you think about that? I really want to go to the pool with you. You have no idea how much. But isn't everything covered with ice? It's winter outside, isn't it? I think we can break the ice and clear the pool of it. Right, guys? Absolutely, you're right. Let's all go and break that ice. Guys, look! This pool hasn't even frozen over yet. There's just a thin layer of ice around the edges. I think we can just swim and nothing will happen. Don't you think that if we swim in a pool that's half ice covered, the water will be cold? No, I think the water will be a nice temperature. Let's try it out. Oh my gosh, the water is so cold, but it's not freezing. No biggie, toughening up is good for you. Stop whining or the pool water will turn salty. Don't joke like that with me. But seriously, I'm starting to freeze. And to warm up, we need to get out of the pool and go on some rides at our amazing digital circus. Yeah, good idea. There's a lot of wind on the rides and it'll dry my fur. Guys, I agree with you. It's too cold to swim in the pool. After all, it's December. Yeah, you're right, guys. We'll have to leave soon so we don't get sick. But before we go, let's jump off the diving boards into the water. Let's all practice diving into the water together. Look how high I jumped that skill. But most importantly, it's so much fun, guys. Jax, jump over here fast. Get some height and dive into the water. Ragatha, please be careful. It's really high and dangerous. Banzai! Way to go, Ragatha! Even athletes would envy you. Girls, I think I'll go home. I'm freezing and I haven't eaten anything today. I want some carrot juice. Jax, you're leaving so soon? Okay, if you've got things to do, see you later. We'll be waiting for you here and come back soon. Don't worry, I won't be long. I'll be back soon. Ragatha, now that Jax has left, what are we going to do to keep ourselves entertained? I don't know what we'll do here. Maybe we can make snowballs and play in the pool. No one's ever done that. We'll figure it out. Ha ha ha. These nerds don't even know I'm nearby. They're going to be so scared when they see me. Sadly, we'll also have to leave this pool soon because we shouldn't get cold. Can't get sick before New Year's. Exactly. That's why Rabbit Jacks went home to warm up and eat carrots. He can't live without those carrots. But we have a big chance of getting sick unlike him. We're at risk because we cooled our bodies down so much. Oh my gosh, look, it's Clown Kaufmo. Oh my gosh. Kaufman, what are you doing here? Beat it nice and easy. Hey guys, I come in peace. I wanted to hang out with you today. Don't expect any pranks from me. Regatha! Let's say if he doesn't do anything bad, then we can hang out with him. Yeah, let's do that. When you all jump into the pool together to swim, the water has already warmed up. Oh my gosh, how do you manage to swim in such cold water? It's practically ice. It's okay, you'll get used to it. You're a villain, right? And you don't have any friends? Actually, I don't have any friends. That's why I decided to come and hang out with you guys. Well, all right then. Let's hang out together. It's really fun to hang out with us. My mood is starting to lift, girls. Ragatha, I don't quite trust him. He seems strange and suspicious, and he looks so grumpy. Yeah, I agree. I definitely wouldn't trust him. We need to stay sharp in case he tries something. Come on, guys. I just want to hang out with everyone. No problems at all. All right, we believe you. We'll trust you until one silly mistake. Make even one blunder and you're out. Okay, I'll try. Guys, let's walk around and warm up by the fire. I'm really cold and it'll be nice to warm up by the fire. Yeah, that's a great idea. The fire looks so majestic. Quick, come outside and I'll show you where the eternal fire is. Just look at this wonderful fire. It's been burning for days and giving off heat. Let's warm up. It feels so good as the warmth spreads through my veins. Let's warm up by this fire for a few minutes. That should be enough. 
I also think he's up to something. I wouldn't trust him at all because it all seems so suspicious. Yeah, he usually only causes trouble. Wait, guys, where did the clown go? We told him to stay here while we left. I don't know, I can't see him. He's just too clever. I need to find everyone who's hiding in this house. One option is to check every mirror. It looks like he left, thinking we didn't want to hang out with him. Seems like it. Otherwise, I can't imagine where he disappeared to or what he's up to. Then you're right. Jump into the water with me and enjoy the cool water. Agreed. All this is indeed very suspicious. Ha ha ha. It seems they didn't believe me. And now they're splashing in the pool as if nothing happened while I'm in a secret room that I built myself. It's right under this pool. Not made for swimming, but for watching those who swim in the pool. Now I can sneak up on them from behind, pull down their swimwear, and steal their stuff. That's my genius plan, and now I'm going to execute it. Hey, Ragatha, where is Kane right now? Kane is in his lab studying a potion. Nothing new there. He's always studying something. His every day is like the previous one. He has no time to hang out with us, completely forgetting about his friends. He's just selfish. Ragatha, what's that noise? Did you hear it too? No, I didn't hear anything. You're imagining things. Ouch! Who touched me? Oh my gosh! Ragatha, look, it's the clown. What did he just do? Ha 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 ha! Just look what I have in my hands. Loser! What did you do, clown? Ragatha! Look! He took off my pants and stole them! Give them back right now! Ha <laughs> ha! My cunning plan really worked and I took your pants. Now you can't get them back because they're mine. And if you try to take them, you're in for trouble. Hey, you clown! Give back my things right now! We believed you. We thought you really became good and reformed. But you stole my pants again! No way, guys! I stole your pants and I'm running away from you and you'll never see me again! Ragatha, what do we do now? I don't know, but it looks like we shouldn't have trusted him. I knew this could end badly. I don't even know how we can catch him. He's faster and more agile than us. But let's try our luck and try to catch him. Hey, clown! Stop! Give us back our stuff! I like how you believe you can catch me, but it's impossible. We caught you, clown! Give back my pants! Oh my gosh, he turned into Kofmo. We need to get out of here fast, or he'll get bigger and might eat us. Seems like we really made him angry and he turned into a monster. What do we do now, friend? I don't know. Maybe we should run to our friends for help? Oh my gosh! Look, he's getting even bigger. Run away, this is very dangerous. He's angry that we ran after him, and now he's chasing us. Guys, this is very bad news. We need to hide from him anywhere. Ragatha, run fast. Let's hide on the second floor in Jax's house. He definitely won't reach us there because he won't fit. I hope Jax is inside and can help. Hey, Jax, urgent news. What happened? Why are you girls so scared? You won't believe what happened. To understand, you need to look out the window right now. Just look. Kafmo is standing outside the window. Oh my gosh, that's really bad news. What happened? Why is Kafmo standing in front of my window? That could be very dangerous for us. In short, we were swimming in the pool when suddenly the clown appeared. But instead of causing trouble, he seemed very charming and kind and offered to be friends and swim in the pool together. So you agreed, right? Yes, we agreed to hang out with him, but he took off my pants at the most unexpected moment. It was awful. And after we chased him, he turned into a monster. And now we're here. Well, girls, that's really bad. I don't even know what to say. So what do we do now, Jax? I don't know. Maybe we should go to Kane and ask for his help? How can we go to Kane if he's busy making potions today? And he asked not to be disturbed. Do you have any other ideas? If you do, suggest them. I've already given mine. I have no idea. But I believe we can come up with something to defeat this huge monster. Just look at how massive and dangerous he is. He's so huge that he often just disappears from sight because the digital circus can't handle a creature of that size? Ha 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 By the sounds of it, they're sitting in their house scared of me. But they don't know I've already turned back into a clown and am about to visit them. It bothers me that Jax is saving them from me. I need to get rid of him somehow. Exactly. I have an idea to lure him into a trap. I know he loves carrots. He can't live without them. So now, I'll scatter these carrots in the snow, and as soon as Jack sees them, he'll start gathering them and fall into the trap I dug a few days ago. Just need to finish building and camouflaging it so it's invisible and Jax doesn't notice the pit. When he falls into it, he won't be able to get out. But this is really a great plan! This way, I can separate them, and the rabbit won't be able to hide the girls in his house anymore. Just look! This trap now looks decent enough. 
Unfortunately, I only had a green carpet, but I hope Jax thinks it's just some planks lying around for house construction. Perfect! The trap is ready! Just have to wait for Jax to come out and notice the scattered carrots. But meanwhile, I'll watch him from behind the tree because from here, I have a great view of the trap and his house. Though, maybe I should move further away, just in case Jax suspects something if I'm too close. I'll hide here and wait for the rabbit. Guys, I'm going down to check what's happening. Maybe I can reach Kane and tell him everything if Kofmo doesn't get me. Need to go downstairs and check the situation because Kofmo disappeared somewhere. Maybe he's waiting around the corner. Wait, guys. Where did this pile of carrots come from? I didn't see it here before. Did I drop it when I was moving the carrot boxes to the basement? What a klutz. Probably that's what happened. Need to pick them up. Wait, guys. There are two more piles of carrots. That looks like someone's carrot bag tore and the carrots fell out while they were being transported. What luck for me! Free carrots never hurt! There's so much carrot here, it's like a feast for me today. Ouch! Oh my gosh, how did I not see this pit? Looks like it's a trap and I fell into it. What do I do now and how do I get out? Who dug this pit trap? Seems like the carrots were bait to lure me here. Ha ha ha. Guys, look. It seems this silly rabbit fell into my trap. He can't think logically at all and fell right in. Hey clown, let me out now. What did you do? Why did you trap me here? There's no sense in this. Help me get out and we'll talk man to man. Ha ha ha! Now you won't get out of here because you're in the way of my plans with your friends. They really angered me today. I just wanted to have fun and steal their stuff, but they chased after me, making me angry. And I won't let you out. Have a carrot so you won't starve. I'll give you one carrot a day. Someone help me. Get me out of here. He really thinks someone will save him from this pit. Of course not. His friends are too scared to come out. Ragatha, listen. Jax is taking too long. He's been gone quite a while and still hasn't returned. I don't like this. Maybe he went far away and hasn't had time to return. Probably he's now talking to Kane or figuring out a plan to get rid of Kofmo. Don't you find it strange that he's been gone so long? Aren't you worried about him? There's nothing strange about it. He's usually very slow like a tortoise. It's just his nature to be slow. No, you're mistaken. He's never late and always arrives early. Are you trying to calm me down? Of course I'm trying to calm you down because I see worry on your face. And yes, anything could be happening to Jax right now. Do you think something very bad happened to Jax? I don't want to think about it. But if it's true, it's very bad. But we need to hope for the best and not lose our minds. Regatha! Look! Kofmo has disappeared! I can't see him in the window! Maybe he's circling around to come up behind us? Most likely he is smart. Not as we thought, but still very scary. Maybe while he's gone, we should go to Kane and tell him everything? I'm sure he can help us. I didn't like this idea initially, but now it seems like the best one. We should fly there quickly! Just be careful. That monster could be anywhere. He could be peeking around any corner to grab us. Is he really not here? This is very strange. Maybe he went to lunch? I hope he's not having our friend Jax for lunch. I don't want to lose him. Kane said he would be working on his portable laboratory today. In it, he develops potions and conducts experiments with rats. So we need to find him because with his mobile laboratory, he could be anywhere. Great. He's right there. He hasn't changed his location. I'm so glad. Kane, listen, we have terrible news. Turn around. Hi, girls. What happened? Why are you so frightened? Something very strange happened. Jax disappeared. He said he was going to get you, but he's been gone for an hour. Strange. He didn't come to me. I don't know what could have happened to him. Yes, and he didn't return to us either. And Kaufmo disappeared too. Can you believe it? What, Kaufmo? You met a clown today? Yes. The clown came to us at the pool today and wanted to be friends with us. But he ended up stealing my pants and turned into Kaufmo. Ma, that's terrible. And what do you want to do? I don't know. But I suggest we go and look for our friend Jax. Sitting around doing nothing is definitely not our style. If Kafmo caught him, that's really bad. Well, I agree with your plan in that direction. Let's not waste time and run. What are we waiting for? Yes, Kane, fly with us if you have time. I hope everything is okay with him, and he's just sitting somewhere in the bushes eating his carrot. We really can only hope for that. Guys, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel if you want us to find our friend Jax as soon as possible. Guys, where was Kafmo last seen? Right here on the ice stood the huge monster Kafmo, and it seems he was looking right into the window of our house and then suddenly disappeared, which is very strange. By the way, after that, Jax went to scout. Guys, let's look around for any clues. If we find any leads, it will be much easier to find our rabbit. Maybe by the tracks or disturbed items. Pomni, do you notice anything? Maybe you've already found something interesting. No clues at all. Everything
everything was as before. Even the carrots and the boxes were in the same places. It seems like nothing strange at all. Only here there's some kind of haystack with pitchforks that weren't there before. That could be a good clue! And look, there's some kind of pit covered with a camo net. Maybe Jax is inside? Guys! Have you lost your minds and even forgotten that this is Kofmo's den? How can you forget that's his headquarters? Are you kidding me? If this is the den of that clown, could it be that Jax is being held captive there? And should we check this basement? You think Jax is there? I don't know! Since the den is closed, it means Jax isn't there! Then let's search. We need to broaden our search radius right now to make sure we don't mess up and find at least one clue. Wait, guys, what's this? I see a pit here. It wasn't here before. Oh my gosh, Pomni. Just look at this. Jax is sitting in the pit. He looks so thin. Jax, tell us what you're doing here. Guys, the clown lured me into this pit. When I left the house, I saw scattered carrots. I followed the tracks and accidentally fell into this pit. It was Kofmo's plan. Oh my gosh, guys. What are we going to do now? How do we get Jax out of this deep pit? We don't have any blocks or ladders with us. Guys, let me run home and bring a rope. I think it will help our Jax. Of course, that's a great idea. Hurry, run home and we'll eagerly wait for you here. Good luck, Ragatha. Come back quickly. Jax, just wait a little longer and we'll save you. Our friend is bringing a rope and we'll be able to pull you out of this pit. Thank you so much for not abandoning me in this difficult moment. Don't worry! Ragatha will help us soon and bring some rope with which you can get out of here. I hope it will be as soon as possible. Pomni, I completely forgot! I have a magical pickaxe with which we can break the blocks that are preventing Jax from getting Great, out! then start right now! Yes, guys, hurry, dig me out quickly! I don't want to sit here! Uh, come on, Jax, get out quickly! I've dug a path for you! Hooray, guys, you saved me! It seems everything worked out, I'm so grateful to you! Jax! How did you even fall into this trap? I thought one of you lost carrots. I followed the tracks and suspected nothing. We would have given you the carrots anyway. Why don't you ever think logically? We wouldn't just scatter carrots in the snow. I just thought someone prepared a gift for me. I don't understand anything. I'm confused. Kofmo trapped Jax, and you wanted to be friends with Kofmo. Can you explain what happened? In short, he came to us at the pool and said he wanted to be friends with us and hang out. He promised he wouldn't play any tricks. Are you out of your minds? You can't trust him. He's a villain. He always does nasty things. Well, it was a big mistake. But at least we learned he will never be good. We just thought he had reformed and gave him a chance. All right, let's forget this incident. Let's hurry to the Christmas tree. I have a few New Year's gifts for you that will really please you. Follow me. I just love gifts, especially when you give them, because they're so cool. Look, guys, these gifts are for you. Take them. Wow, Kane, so generous. Thank you so much. And what's inside this gift? You'll find out later. Don't open them now. Also, look at these gifts for our digital viewers. If they leave a lot of likes, we will definitely raffle these gifts among them. Now I'll tell you what to do for this. To win these gifts, which could be an iPhone, PlayStation, or Xbox, you need to write your real address in the comments so we can send you the prize if you win. Also, make sure to subscribe to the channel and like the video. It's a must. Thank you so much for watching. This ends our series. This is Pomni and my nerdy friend saying bye-bye. Jax, are you for real saying you didn't peep at me while I was taking a bath? I swear to the stars, why don't you believe me? I wasn't spying on you. And you're telling me that hole in the ceiling just appeared out of nowhere? Yeah, that's my secret carrot stash. Wait, what? A carrot stash under my bathroom? Have you lost your marbles? Yeah, I thought no one would steal or see my carrots there. So I built the stash between your floors. And you're saying this photo here is also just randomly here? Yep, just adding some vibes to the decor. My house is getting filled with your stuff. That's totally not true. Something's fishy, Jax. Let's go up to your room right now and see what you're hiding. Oh no, you definitely can't go up to my room. That's off limits. You're obviously hiding something from me, Jax. I'm not hiding anything, for real. You're just making stuff up to kick me out. No, let's actually go up to your floor and see what's up there. Because I need to know what's between my floors. Oh, Pomni, I accidentally broke your window. My bad. Why did you break my window? You sneaky trickster, stop right there. You won't get away from me. You broke my stuff. Guys, just look at what Jax did. He broke my window and still talks back to me. And he ran away instead of paying for the repairs or fixing it. Stop talking trash about me. Where did you run off to? And why did you break my window? I needed a distraction. I was scared you'd find out what's in that room, and you definitely shouldn't. I'm speechless. Not only did you spy on me in the bath, but you also broke my window. No shame, no conscience. You've totally crossed the line. Oh, please forgive me, friend. Look at all the presents under the tree. They're all so bright and different. Yeah, these are New Year's gifts for our digital viewers, and for us too. Can't wait to open them. Hey, Jax, I have a question for you. Do you know where Kane is right now? Eh, no, I haven't seen him. But if I'm not mistaken, 
He's building a new attraction at the beach. Right you are! He's actually on the beach, swinging a hammer! Looks like he's really building a new attraction! Can't wait to try out the attraction once it's finished! But since the attraction isn't built yet, let's decide what we're gonna do. I don't know, but it's been ages since I last saw Ragatha. She's super busy right now. The New Year's coming. She's wrapping presents in pretty paper, so she can't come out to hang. Alright, I really hope we can hang out with her soon. I miss her! Seriously? You miss her? Am I not enough for you? Ha ha ha! Hey guys! Did I interrupt your kiss? Oh my gosh, why scare us like that? And no! We weren't kissing! Tell us! Why are you here? Don't you know? Today is the day of good deeds! And in honor of this day and the upcoming new year, I decided to give you gifts. What? From such a statement, I'm totally freaked out! You want to give us a gift? I'm super surprised! What kind of gift is it? My gift is this magic potion with the coolest properties. You'll be amazed! And what properties does it have? You'll find out soon. Surprises are meant to be unexpected, right? It looks really weird. Are you sure it's safe and we can use yeah, it? Yeah, totally. It's an awesome potion. I've tried it a few times myself. The only side effect might be becoming superheroes, but that's a plus. This is super suspicious. Should we risk it? Remember, life's a risk, so I advise you to try this potion. I'm really wary of this. Jax, do you think it's a good idea? I wouldn't take any potion from Kaufmo. Remember, Kane warned us that this clown never does anything just because, and he always has an evil motive. Come on, guys! Kane was wrong! Yeah, I'm evil, but today's the day of good deeds. Today, I'm nice. So, huddle up closer, and I'll toss this potion at you. Uh, Omni, maybe we shouldn't risk it. Come on, Jax! Don't be a bore! We only live once! We gotta try it! I don't know, I really don't like this. I have a bad feeling! Guys, hurry up and think! I'm ready to throw the potion at you, but okay, I won't wait for your response. Catch the potion, woohoo! So guys, how does it feel, feeling anything? Doesn't seem like it. Oh wait, why can't I move away from you? Can't move away from you either, Pomni. What happened? Kalfmo, what did you do? Guys, sorry I couldn't answer your question, but I've got urgent business at the Digital Circus. Good luck with your life together. Oh no, Jax, looks like we're in big trouble. It seems we're now bound to each other with an invisible chain. Oh my god, Pomni, I'm scared to think how we're going to live now. We need to come up with a way to untie ourselves. Do you have any ideas? We probably need to find some antidote potion to help us. You know who's good with potions, right? Of course, it's Kane. Let's go to him on the beach, but it's going to be tough because we're now bound together. Oh yeah, it's really tough. Our invisible chain restricts our movements. We can't even run fast. I can't even move away from you. This is terrible. When was the last time you bathed? I don't bathe. I lick my fur clean. Look, there's Kane on the beach. He'll help us. Hey, Kane. Please take a break from your construction and turn around. What happened? Why are you yelling? We were at the tree today when Kafmo threw some potion at us. We didn't want it, but now we're stuck. Oh, guys, this is really, really bad. What am I supposed to do with you? I don't know. I've never dealt with this kind of magic before. Kane, please, think of something. I have no ideas. I don't even know what to think of. I don't have an antidote that can save you from this curse. It's too strong. But you know potions. You're a pro. Maybe you can brew an antidote for us? I don't know how to help you, but I have one idea that might save you. You need to break into Kafmo's lair. He has a collection of the strongest potions on the planet. I think we'll find the antidote there. But don't you think breaking into his lair will be super dangerous and risky? Well, I did say it's dangerous. But you guys don't have another choice. Either stay bound together for life or go for it. It's not for me to decide. But we can't even move away from each other. Seems like some kind of binding potion. How are we supposed to sneak into Kofmo's place like this? I get it, but there's nothing I can do. You'll have to make a choice. So can you at least tell us where to go? We have no clue where his lair is. First, follow me. I have a bit of a plan, and maybe we'll come up with something while we're on the move. Okay, I hope your plan is slightly different from storming into Kafmo's lair, because I'm not a fan of that idea. Wait, guys, change your plans! Follow me! I've got a little idea that might just help your hopeless situation. Those words give me hope that we won't have to sneak into the clown's lair and try to steal an antidote. Man, Jax! I really don't want to crawl underground and wander through some stinky, damp clown basement. Maybe some leftover potion from my lab might help you. I've got a bunch of different potions here, but most likely none of them will work. I don't have an antidote that can unbind you. I've never seen or brewed such a thing in my life. 
But if you manage to steal one, I'll definitely study it and make a duplicate! Stop talking to yourself and just tell us where to find the original antidote! As I said, there's only one option left! Go to Kofmo's lair! You have no other choice! Oh no, I really don't like this at all! But you guys got yourselves into this mess, so it's your job to fix it! Come on, follow me, I'll show you the way! Fine, we have no choice but to follow you! I have no choice but to follow you, Pomni! We're bound together after all. Guys, let's move faster. Why are you so slow? We can't move any faster, Kane, because we're bound together. These invisible chains are limiting our movements. Got it, but I'll have to bear with you slow pokes. Just don't fall behind. We need to get to the amazing digital circus as fast as we can. We're trying as hard as we can. By the way, guys, I got a bit carried away and prepared a whole bunch of New Year's gifts. Just look at how many there are. Wow, there are so many. It's unbelievable. I've never seen so many gifts in one place. You know these gifts are not just for us, but for our digital viewers too, but, right? Of course, Kane. We remember. We never forget about our subscribers. And but these gifts, guys, can be won if they write their real address in the comments. If they win our New Year's contest, we can send a package to that address with an incredible prize inside. But I got sidetracked. Let's teleport inside the digital circus already. Guys, look! Here we are finally in the amazing digital circus, finally inside! Wow, it's so beautiful and epic here, but it's not decorated for New Year's at all. Yeah, since Kofmo lives here, my authority ends, and we didn't decorate anything. Only his stage looks festive. The rest is abandoned. Yeah, it feels quite unwelcoming here. I think his main lair is on the stage, so we should head there. You sure it's not dangerous? Yes, it's very dangerous, but that's probably where his stash of spare potions is. We have no choice but to head there. Where is this stage? I'll show you. Follow me quickly. See? Over there in the distance? That's the stage. Wow, this stage is really huge. Is this his house or a penthouse? Yeah, this is indeed his home. He lives here every day on this giant stage. That's why it's now his territory, and we have to avoid this place and go around Whoa, it. Whoa, Kane, that sounds super creepy. Yeah, I'm really scared right now, too. Then let's check out his place while he's apparently not home. Oh my gosh, guys, look at all these different gifts. He even has two personal Christmas trees. And even a box of sodas. Actually, I made those trees. I decorated and cut them down, and the clown just boldly stole them. So I should take back what's stolen. I'll take the trees with me if you don't mind. Of course, mind. Kane, you should take back what's stolen. I think we should also take back some gifts. He keeps stealing from us and bringing them here. We need to take back what rightfully belongs to us. Just look at how many gifts he has stolen from us. He really did steal a lot from us. The most important thing is that he doesn't notice that we took anything. And if he does, it's going to be really bad. He'll want to steal even more to get back at us. Let's move on then. We need to find where he hides his potions. But be careful, it's really dangerous to enter here. We might face danger. All right, we'll be super careful, Kane. We're the most cautious kids around. Wow, guys, what's this map? I don't know. Let's see what's on it. Wait, guys, I think I've got it. This map shows where some potion is hidden. I'm sure we need it. It says it's a splitting potion. Probably what you need to break the spell. Are you sure it can help us? Absolutely, this potion will definitely help. I still don't understand the map, though, where to go and where this potion is but it seems it's inside the circus. Then let's hurry before he returns home. First, look at this scary place filled with lava. Better not mess around here, it could be lethal. So let's quickly leave this place and search for the potion indicated on the map. Uh, which way should we go? I think we'll figure it out. But according to the map, we need to go up high, somewhere above the ground. Guys, I'm really scared of heights. I don't think I can climb up some high place. Maybe we shouldn't go anywhere. You choose to walk together, bound to each other for life. I think it's better to overcome your fear and go up high. Yeah, Jax. How can you think about fear of heights when finding this potion is so crucial? Come on, follow me quickly and don't fall behind. Let's hurry, Kane, because I can't wait to take this potion with Jax. I'm so tired of being stuck with him for so long. Only guys, I don't understand where to go. Right or left, I'm really bad with maps. It was a problem for me even in school. Then give me your map. I'll figure out where to go. I'm really good with maps. Here. Take it and find the right path. Got it! I know where to go from just one look. It's not far. Follow me, I know the right way. We'll reach our destination soon. Thanks, Jax, for helping with directions. I haven't been in the digital circus for so long, I'm starting to get confused about where everything is. Kane, don't worry. Just because Kofmo took over your digital circus doesn't mean it won't return to your hands. We'll definitely win it back from the clown, and it will be under your control again. Thanks, guys, for the big support. I really appreciate it. I didn't know you were so caring and understanding. You truly can support each other and me. Guys, stop. If the map is right, we're here. The potion should be somewhere around here, but it's not clear exactly where because the map is a bit off. Let's check it out, guys. I can't see anything either. Wait, stop. Right. I'll scan the area with artificial intelligence and figure out where we need to go.
Guys, according to my computer data, the place is ahead. Let's go there. Awesome. Kane's artificial intelligence always helps at the right moment. I love how it works in emergencies like ours. Looks like we need to climb up this pipe or whatever this elongated thing is. Nah, who even thought of hiding the potion on this giant sculpture? Don't you get it, Kane? Kafmo hid the potion here, so it's no surprise it's in such a weird place. Makes sense, he can fly after all, and he chose this spot to make a secret stash for the potion. It's going to be harder to climb up there on foot, but we'll find the treasure. You're really smart, Kane. Where's this chest? I can't understand anything. Hope we'll find it soon. I'm tired of climbing up here. Man, Kane, we're also so tired. There are so many steps, and it's scary with cliffs on both sides. Guys, breaking news. I finally found some chest. This must be what we need. Hurry over here. Let's open it. Guys, inside is a potion that removes all magic properties. This will definitely help you. Hooray, Kane. Excellent. Throw it to us quick. I can't wait to be free from this binding. Guys, just don't be mad. But it's too dangerous to throw the potion here. We need to go down, and only there can we use it safely. All right, let's go down. So, guys, here we are at the bottom. Are you ready for me to throw this potion at you? Let's see if it works. Of course, throw it at us. Well, guys, did it work? Honey, do you feel anything? Yes, it worked perfectly. Now we can run around separately, and nothing's holding us back. Oh my gosh, guys! I'm so glad the potion worked! I suggest we go to my former restaurant now and celebrate with cake and tea, because your freedom is what matters most! We haven't been to your restaurant in so long, and it's been ages since we were at the Digital Circus. I miss these familiar places. I used to sit in your restaurant and enjoy carrot cake. That's where I fell in love with carrots. I really regretted that cake was on my menu. I've had enough of your cake, so I wouldn't order it again. But thanks for the good times! That cake made me love carrots, carrot juice, carrot puree, carrot steaks, and carrot patties. Pomni, let's go into your old house! Yeah! I'd like to go in and pick up some old stuff I forgot when we had to leave the digital circus in a hurry! Guys, look how cool it is here with so much pink! Great, guys! I've gathered all the things I needed that I forgot when moving. We can head to your restaurant now! Yes, guys, let's hurry to my restaurant! I also forgot some stuff there! It would be great if I could retrieve them if the clown hasn't stolen them yet! Look how cool it is in my restaurant! Guys, sit down at the table and get comfortable! You're about to taste some delicious cake! I thought we'd sit at the bar! But you're treating us to cake? Let's move over and try it! It smells so delicious, just an incredible aroma! Yes! This cake is made from a French recipe! I baked it just for you! I don't know how many years it's been here, but the candles are still burning because they're LED! I don't really feel like eating an expired cake! Sorry, but I'm not going to eat it. I think we should come back to this restaurant soon, like in the next episode, and I'll bake you a fresh, tasty cake to celebrate your engagement. Engagement? What are you talking about? Oh, it's nothing special. Just a joke. Let's get out of this digital place because I'm fed up with being here. And agreed. I really need some fresh air. The stale air of the digital circus has dried out my nose too much. Exactly. I'm also tired of breathing this dusty air. We need to get out and breathe some fresh oxygen. So, let's follow me and run towards the teleportation pad to freedom. Great! Jax, teleport next to me! You got it, Pomni. Guys, look! Finally, we're out in the open and can breathe the fresh, free air of the amazing digital circus! Then let's head to the beach quickly and celebrate our return. I hope our subscribers are also happy that we're finally out and walking under the blue sky. The most important thing is to learn our lesson and never agree to accept gifts or any potions from the clown again. By the way, guys, look at my atomic reactor. With it, spring will soon come to the digital circus and all the ice and snow will melt. Wow, that's really cool. I didn't know you controlled the weather, not nature. Guys, our episode has come to an end. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and like because this episode was really interesting and educational. And don't forget to participate in the gift contest we will have on New Year's Eve. To participate, write your address in the comments. It was me, Pomni, and my friends. Bye-bye. Hey there, awesome friends! Welcome to the amazing Digital Circus. It's me again, your buddy Pomni, and I'm here with my botanist pals. Today, we've all gathered to take a stroll. Actually, today's our date, guys. Did you forget? Jax! That was just a joke! We're just out for a walk. Forget the date! So what are we gonna do today, Pomni? Honestly, haven't figured it out yet. But I suggest we hit the beach first and decide there what we'll do today. Let's hurry to the beach. I can't wait to breathe in that lake air. Guys, look! It's full-on winter in our amazing digital circus, and it's snowing. 
Everyone's gearing up for the new year. It's only five days away. We're working hard for the new year. Gifts prepped and planning our New Year's Eve bash. Plus, we've got gifts for you, our digital audience. We'll show you soon and tell you how to win them. Guys, check it out. Our lake's totally frozen over. Man, I wish I could swim in its warm waters right now. Missing summer so much. Guys, hit like and subscribe if you're waiting for summer and those summer breaks. But hey, now we can boat across this icy lake. I think in the next episodes, we'll definitely have a real race. I mean, a competition on this ice. Guys, we came to this beach to decide what we're doing today, right? Exactly. What are we going to do today? I'm totally out of ideas. Jax, what do you think? I don't know, Pomni, but I miss our pool so much. I'd give anything for a swim in it. That's a great idea. I just hope the pool water isn't as cold as last time. My wrist cramped up so bad. Yeah, we can totally go swimming in the pool. It'll be fun, and our viewers love watching us swim. Just afraid it might be super cold and the pool's all iced over, right? Today I washed up in that pool. The water's really warm, and if we get cold and soaked, there's a fire pit to warm up by. All right, let's hit the pool. By the way, where's Kane? Haven't seen him today. Started shooting this episode in the digital circus, but didn't see Kane there. I don't know where he is, but he said he'd spend all day in his lab studying rats. He's testing potions on them. Didn't hear anything about a lab. What potion is he testing? I don't know what he's testing in his lab. That's the lab near the mysterious portal. It's super interesting, but I bet he'll get bored and come hang out with us soon. Guys, enough chatting. Let's go swim in the pool. <sighs> Let's dive into our pool water. Look, it's a bit icy around the edges, but overall it's swim ready. Just don't touch the ice. It's super sharp and can easily tear up our clothes. Hey, Pomni, what are you doing? You almost pushed me in. Stop touching me. I'm not tactile, eh? Well, if you're not tactile, then you need to become one. Jump in the water, botanist. Oh my god, it's so cold here. Such an ice bath. <laughs> I pushed you in so unexpectedly, and you fell so clumsily. Ragatha, come down into the water. I'm jumping in too. Oh my god, in such cold water, there's no room for fun. You can only catch a cold in this. Yeah, it's cool today, but what did you expect in December? Exactly. Winter's here, and we have to deal with the fact that the pool water isn't the warmest. But look at that sky. Isn't it way prettier in winter? I could watch it forever, like meditation. Pomni. There's no room for philosophy on our channel. Sorry, guys. Got carried away with some nonsense there. You really scared me with your behavior. It looked like you were drowning. Please, Pomni, don't do that again. It looks terrifying. There you go again. Stop diving. Hey, Jax, what are your plans for today? What do you want to do today? To be honest, I'd really like to go on a date with you. You want to go on a date with me? Who are you? And who am I? It's like going on a date with a pig. Well, I don't want to stoop to that level. Okay, I was just kidding. I agree to go on a date with you. Oh, wow, that's great. Then this evening we can spend time together. All right, it's a date. Let's meet at 4 p.m. I agree to go on a date with you. I'm ready to be with you forever. How can you talk about such things in front of others? I may not be a stranger, but we're all hanging out together and you two are planning a date just for yourselves. Regatha, you got it all wrong. The thing is, we are indeed hanging out together now, but in the evening, Jax and I will go on a date, so there's nothing wrong with that. You seriously want to go on a date without inviting me? I should be the star of your date. You've lost your minds. I'll consider your proposal and maybe someday invite you to a triple date. But I think it won't be today unless Pomni wants it. You misunderstood, Ragatha. Don't be offended. I understood perfectly, and now I'm leaving you. I don't want to be around traitors. Goodbye, guys. I can't even call you friends anymore. I'm so upset with them, and now I don't want to talk to them anymore. How could they betray me? I'm their best friend. I just got an idea on how to teach them a lesson. You'll find out soon, but I'll keep it a secret for now to make this episode more interesting. I think it's a truly brilliant plan to put these egoists, Pomni and Jax, in their place. They'll remember this for the rest of their lives, and they'll never refuse me again. I hope you're ready to see this. It's incredible. I thought up this trap a long time ago, but I think now's the time to use it. Just need to remember where I hid it. It was so long ago, I can't remember. Right, it's not behind the lighthouse. It's inside the lighthouse. How could I forget that? Great, I'm in position. Here, I'll set a trap for my friends, or rather, I can't call them friends anymore. A trap for my offenders, or more simply, traitors. My plan is to make a trap here and lure Pomni. And when she comes, she'll fall through because I'll disguise the pit with special camouflage material. While Pomni is stuck in this trap, I'll go on a date with Jax. It annoys me that he pays more attention to Pomni than to me. Guys, look how well this is turning out. 
The camouflage blends perfectly with the neighboring floor. This means if Pomni isn't careful with the floor covering, she won't even realize there's a real pit here. Too bad I had to break a piece of the wall to get out and not fall into my own trap, but strategy requires sacrifices. All right, I'll put the wall back so as not to give away the trap. I hope this trap works. Actually, I'm sure my trap works. Now, I need to hurry to Pomni and try to lure her here. I think she won't agree just like that, so I'll say there's some kind of surprise for her here. Excellent, guys. I've prepared everything for my plan, and now I need to call, or rather lure, Pomni into my pit. Look how few gifts are under this umbrella, but I think Kane will bring much more as New Year's approaches. So, write your real address in the comments to participate in the New Year's gift contest. If you win, we can send it to you, and also like and subscribe to the channel to participate in the contest. I won't waste another minute and we'll go try to lure Pomni out of the pool and make her follow me. Guys, I'm back! How are you? What are you doing? As you see, we're swimming and having a great time. We've really fallen for each other today. Ragatha, I can tell from your behavior that you want something from us. Why did you come? Confess! I came to say that I have a gift for you. Actually, the gift is only for Pomni. Can you believe it? I prepared a real surprise for her. Friends should spoil each other with gifts. You're serious? You prepared a surprise for me? But you were mad at me. I didn't think upset people give gifts. No, it's not like that. Actually, I'm not upset. I admit I was wrong, so as an apology, I want to make a surprise for you. I totally love gifts and surprises. It's my passion. Actually, I love gifts, too. Can you give me a gift as well? No, sorry, Jax. There's no gift for you today. The gift is only for Pomni. I knew it. Always forgotten about me. But I'll remember what you did. You won't get a gift from me for New Year's. Sorry, Jax. But Pomni, follow me. I'll show you where your surprise is because it can't be moved. We have to go to it. I'm really curious about what it is. Follow me. I'll show you what I've prepared for you for New Year's and as an apology. I think you'll really, really like this surprise. It's truly cool. I'm amazed that you went to such lengths to prepare a gift. By the way, do we have far to go? Because I'm starting to get tired of walking. You'll find out soon. It's going to be really interesting. The gift is inside this lighthouse. Yes, right inside it. Weird. What kind of gift could be in a lighthouse? This is so suspicious but so intriguing. I can't believe you prepared such a cool gift that you hid it in a lighthouse. I promise. There's something unusual there. You'll have incredible emotions. It's strange. Why are you giving a gift to me and not someone else? Well, because you're my only friend here. It's not practical to give gifts to guys. They can buy everything for themselves. All right, then. I believe you. I'll go into this lighthouse and see what's there. And what's this, Ragatha? It's a dead end here. Just go straight ahead. All right. Ouch, what's this hole in the floor? Where have I just fallen into? Haha, <laughs> perfect Pomni fell into the trap. My plan worked brilliantly. Hey, what are you doing? Why did you set this trap for me? Get me out of here right now. I won't let you out no matter how much you beg. Maybe you could at least explain why all this? Just because I'm jealous that you're hanging out with Jackson, I'm not. That's a mean thing to do. Let me out. We're supposed to be good friends. Why did you trap me here? You said there was a surprise for me here. You lied. But now I can go on a date with Jax while you sit here and cry, wiping your tears with your sleeve. Please don't leave me here alone. Great, guys. It worked and she fell into my trap. Now she can't get out and the worms will eat her. Now nothing will stop me from asking Jax out on a date. And I'm sure he'll agree because he's very simple and doesn't care which girl he goes on a date with. But it's important to me who he goes on a date with. I hope he agrees and is in a good mood right now. Because I want to drink tea, take a walk, and hopefully he'll kiss me goodbye. Guys, look, there's Kane. Hi, buddy. Hi, Ragatha. Good to see you. What are you doing here alone? Oh, nothing. Just walking. I try to breathe fresh air every day. I'm free now and finished working, so could you keep me company and take a walk with me? It's just so boring being alone on the beach. Sure, let's go swim in the pool and call Jax. Great idea. Let's hurry. Hey, Jax. What are you doing here? Why aren't you swimming in the pool? I saw that there are many interesting things here. Board games, drinks, and all unclaimed. I decided to check them all out. I love drinks and board games. Yeah, drinks are delicious. Especially, I love drinking Coca-Cola. It's my favorite drink. Guys, shall we swim in the pool? You know, Kane, I'm so tired of the pool for today. And besides, my fur is still wet. I'd rather go ice boating. That's indeed a great idea to go ice boating. I'm in. Yeah, let's head to the lake, hop in boats, and have a race. It's going to be super fun. Yeah, let's head to the lake, hop in boats, and have a race. It's going to be super fun. But hey, guys, what if we skate on the ice track instead? It's way safer. All right, team, check it out. We're already near our ice track. Let's grab the boats from the chest and glide on the ice. The first one to the finish line wins. 
This is gonna be so cool! We're catching up to you, Kane. You're in trouble now. No chance of winning. He's got no shot. We'll overtake him. Oh no, guys! Something's up with my boat. It's stuck or frozen to the ice. Wait for me. Just a small hiccup. I'll be there in a jiffy. Awesome. Am I moving? But man, steering this boat is tough. It's all over the place. Must have gotten up on the wrong side of the bed today, because I'm swaying side to side. Can't even make these tight turns. Guys, I'm getting seasick. Wait up. Why are you all so far ahead? Newbies should be up front and respected. It's my first time in this kind of ride. We'll wait for you at the finish line. Hurry up! I finally made it a bit late, but I'm here. Proud of myself. Hey guys, where's Pomni? Why isn't she hanging out with us? Didn't get sick from swimming every day, did she? Kane, no worries. She's not sick. She hung out with us, then swam, and then Ragatha gave her a gift and took her away. Did she like your gift, Kane? Where did she go then? True, I gave her a gift, then she decided to go home to rest. I don't know what happened next, because I went for a walk with Jax right away. That's a bummer. It's not as fun without her. I'd love to give her a hug right now. Maybe we should swing by her place. See if she's up for a walk or help out if she's not feeling well. Guys, I think she's really tired today. She kept falling asleep, so maybe we shouldn't disturb her. It wouldn't be cool. No, we're her friends. We should help each other out. So let's go check on her, see if she's okay or if her health took a dive. Yeah, Kane, you're right. We need to see how she's doing. She might really be feeling unwell. We should be ready to help. Guys, maybe we shouldn't go to her place after all. I don't want to wake her up. She'll be grumpy because of her insomnia. She's always trying to sleep, and we'll just wake her up during her nap, which is double terrible. But it's weird that she went home so quickly then. Nothing weird about it. She was just really tired. Let's check on her quietly so we don't wake her up. Oh no, looks like she's not here. No sign she was here recently either. This is super worrying. But if she's not here, where could she be considering how tired she was? She's not sleeping in a snowdrift, is she? I don't know. Let's check upstairs. Maybe she's there. Yeah, good idea. There's a big chance Pomni's upstairs chilling in the jacuzzi. Follow me up the stairs quietly so we don't scare her. All right, I'm coming up behind you. I hope Pomni's really in the jacuzzi right now. Wait for me, guys. I'm coming. So is Pomni up here or is she still missing? Uh, she's not here either. This is so strange. The jacuzzi water is cold, which means Pomni hasn't been here since morning. Listen, Ragatha, are you hiding something from me? You want to tell me something? Why would you think I want to tell you something? No, I'm not hiding anything. Why would you think that? Judging by how you're shaking with fear, it seems like you're definitely hiding something. All right, guys, I'll tell you everything. Just don't hit me, please. The thing is, I was super jealous of Pomni because she was going on a date with Jax. So I set up a trap for her to eliminate my competition for the bunny's heart and hand. Have you lost your mind? A trap for a friend? How could you even think of that? Kane, let's go down, Ragatha. Show us where this trap is right now. Okay, I'll show you the trap. Don't worry, she's fine. There were no bear traps or spikes. It's just a regular pit. She's sitting there waiting for someone to help her out. Ragatha, you've gone crazy. You know we shouldn't do this, especially to our friends. I know, but at that moment, I was only thinking about the date with you. Morality didn't even cross my mind. I still can't believe you could stoop so low. This is just terrible. I'll never forgive you. Ragatha, where do we go? Is it far? No, we're almost there. My trap is near the lighthouse, only about 100 meters left. Great, then hurry and show us the way because this place is huge. I doubt I'll find the trap where Pomni is. Here we are, guys. Pomni is inside the lighthouse. Come on in. Guys, help me, please. Get me out of here. Ragatha, why did you lock me in here? You're awful and cold-blooded. Pomni, what happened to you? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Just Ragatha lured me into this trap under the guise of a gift. I've been sitting here for two hours? Because she was jealous of us. She was envious that you were going on a date with me, and she wasn't. So, she decided to eliminate the competition. Help me get out of here! Please break it faster! Does anyone have a pickaxe or some tool to get me out of here quicker? Earthworms are starting to crawl on me! Climb out now! Thank you so much, Kane! I'm so grateful you helped me out of that pit! I couldn't have done it alone! And I would have broken a nail! Rag why did you do this? Confess why you locked me in that pit! I felt like I was Mr. Beast, buried alive! It was horrible. I'm waiting for your apology. Please forgive me, guys. I was just envious and wanted to go on a date with Jax. In short, I wanted to be in your place, in your skin, Pomni. Guys, please don't fight. We're still friends. We should live in harmony, right? Yeah, Kane, you're right. Okay, we won't fight, but I'm still upset with Ragatha. Thanks for the flower, Jax. Ragatha here, this is for you. Uh, thank you so much, Pomni. I feel like our friendship isn't totally lost. Let's run to the tree and open some of the Christmas presents. I'm super curious to see what comes out of these lucky blocks. Yeah, let's go. I'm also really curious to see what's in the gifts. 
I hope there's a brand new electric scooter. Jax, keep your dreams to yourself. The main thing is everything ended on a good note today. I hope Regatha won't act like this anymore. If she does it again, we'll punish her by putting her in jail for 15 days. But today, I'll turn a blind eye to this incident. Thank you so much. You're very kind because I wouldn't want to spend New Year's in jail. Guys, let's hurry to the tree. I already see a ton of gifts under it. Guys, look how many gifts we have here. Looks like Santa Claus brought them here. Yeah, but we'll open these gifts in the next episode because it's time to wrap up. So, dear friends, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe to the channel if you liked this episode because it was really interesting. Also, write in the comments your real address so we can send you Christmas gifts. And with you was me, Pomni, and my botanist friends. Bye-bye. Welcome to the amazing Digital Circus. Today, Jax decided to sneak into Pomni's house and spy on her in the bathroom. Hey guys, today's video is going to be super fun and awesome. It'll totally lift your mood and make you smile. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel. Oh man, guys, today I want to sneak a peek at Pomni. I've got this clever plan and Pomni won't have a clue, just in case I've got a backup plan to make a quick exit. I've been thinking about how to sneak a peek at Pomni when she's taking a bath and figured out a way to build a bridge from my house to hers. Wow, yeah, the view from here is legit. Now I can watch Pomni taking her bath through her window, and if she spots me, I'll just bolt back to my place. Wow! I just love taking baths. It's such an amazing way to chill out and take care of myself. Yeah, for real! Taking baths in this incredible digital world is super cool! I really like it! I think Pomni's getting suspicious. Gotta dash back to my place before she sees me. Oh my gosh, guys! I absolutely love taking a hot bath. It's such an awesome way to chill out and take care of myself in this wild digital circus. Taking a bath is so nice! Seriously, guys, a hot bath really helps to unwind after a tough day. I wonder where my friends are. Gotta head downstairs and check! Let's go, guys! I'm super curious about where Jax is. Oh my gosh! What is this, guys? It looks like some kind of bridge leading to Jax's house. To my house! What does it mean? Who built this bridge, guys? We need to go up and see! Really curious about who built this bridge and why! So, let's head up and figure it all out! So guys, I'm already upstairs. Let's break this glass to try to figure out what's happening here. Yeah, really, everything looks super weird and it's unclear who would need to build this bridge. Oh my gosh! Guys, it's Jax, it's you, I just knew it! Get over here now! Jax, did you build this bridge to watch me? No, no, I wasn't watching you. I didn't build this bridge at all. I don't know where it came from. I've been with Kane all this time. I have no clue where this bridge could have come from. I definitely didn't have anything to do with it. Come on, Jax, come on out! What will Kane say if I ask him whether he was with you? Why did this weird bridge end up leading right to my window? All right, it was me. I just wanted to connect our home so we could easily visit each other. Are you kidding me? I know why you built this bridge. To spy on me in the bathroom. This bridge leads right to my window. Remove your bridge before Kane sees it. Meanwhile, I'll go for a walk and check on Kane. Kane, Kane, hello? You look really strange and unusual, like something's changed in you. You've changed a lot. Oh yes, the thing is, in our amazing digital circus, there's been a new update, and now my model looks much better than before. Write in the comments which Kane model you think is better, the new one or the old one. Yeah, you really do look better than before, but that's not what we're talking about right now. I need your help, Kane. Jax is spying on me again. Now he's built a bridge to my house to watch me. Well, I have an idea. I recently got some new cameras and I can give them to you. We'll place cameras in Jax's house, and you can watch him anytime. Here, take these cameras and the computer you can use to watch Jax. Can we install the cameras without Jax noticing them? Because if he sees the cameras, he'll definitely break them. The cameras are very discreet. He definitely won't notice them because he usually doesn't notice anything except his missing carrot. Ha ha! Yes, Pomni, take these cameras, the computer, blocks, and a ladder. They'll help you sneak into his house and set up the cameras. Kane, will you help me install the cameras in his house? It would be really boring to do it alone. Just keep an eye out to make sure Jax doesn't come home and see us installing the cameras. Distract him if needed. Yeah, sure, I remember. I can help you. Why does Jax always bother you? 
It seems like he likes you. That's why he behaves like this. Well. Look, Kane. Do you see? There's no window here. Come over here. Look, this is the very bridge that Jack's built. All right. Now I'll break this bridge and we'll set up the cameras. Be careful. Don't fall. Just like that. Good. Yes. I think this spot for the camera will be very good. What do you think, Kane? He won't notice it, will he? This spot is really good for a camera. I think Jax won't notice it! Jax won't notice the camera! So now I'll connect it like this to the computer. There, the camera is connected. Just two more cameras to place, then I can watch Jax at any time. Now, I'll break these blocks. Kane, can you please board up my window while I set up the cameras in Jax's house? Yes. Yes, I'll board up the window and then we'll go set up cameras in Jax's house. Wait for me downstairs. I'll come down in a bit. So guys, I need to quickly go down the ladder and set up the rest of the cameras. All right, guys. Let's put a camera here and then go up the ladder into Jax's house to place cameras so I can see what's happening in his house. We have to get up to gently climb the stairs. Come on, guys. I can! Look! There's Jax looking out the window! Be very careful! While he's distracted looking out the window, we need to set up the cameras, connect them, and leave unnoticed. Great! You did it! Let's go! Come down, Kane, faster! Hurry, get down the ladder before he sees us! Looks like you were right! He really doesn't notice anything! Ha ha ha! Now I have access to video from his house any time. Thank you so much, Kane. I couldn't have done it without you. Glad I could help. If you need anything, just ask. Jax has been behaving badly lately and really deserves a punishment. If he tries to spy on you again or builds another bridge, tell me and I'll help deal with him. All right, good, Kane. If I need help, I'll ask you. Thanks. I'll go home and watch what Jax is up to on my computer. I'm really curious about what he's doing and whether he'll spy on me again. Oh my gosh, just look at him. He's going to build another bridge, that naughty guy. Why is he doing this? I told him not to build a bridge, but he wants to spy on me again. Now he's about to finish the bridge and will start spying on me again. Guys, he built a bridge right to my window, and now he's going to watch me in the bathroom. Guys, look, he's almost finished his bridge. Look, guys, he's peering through the window into my room. Let's switch to another camera and see what's there. Jax has already returned to his house, and he seems upset that I wasn't there. Look at him, he's back at his house. Ho, ho, I built the bridge to her window again. But unfortunately, she's not home. Well, no big deal, I'll come by later and watch her, haha. -ha. So guys, I have to go and tell about it, Kane. Guys, did you hear what he said? He wants to spy on me again. But I wasn't home. So let's go up to my bathroom and see what's happening there. Really curious why Jax built his bridge again. Indeed, the cameras weren't lying. The bridge is built. I need to hurry down and go to Kane. He can definitely help me figure out how to teach Jax a lesson. Let's run, guys. I'll tell Kane everything and he'll surely help me. Jax needs to be taught a lesson. Kane? Kane? Are you home? I need your help again. Jax has built another bridge from my house to his, and he's spying on me when I'm in the bath. I just saw him on the camera. Holy moly! I didn't even know Jax was capable of that. Good thing we installed the cameras. Now we have proof it was really Jax. He needs to be taught a lesson. Yes! I saw him building his bridge to me! He built the bridge, and then looked through the window into my room, didn't see me, and went back to his house. I heard him saying that I wasn't home, but he'll return later when I'm taking a bath again. Hmm, looks like that might really be the case. Do you have any ideas on how to teach him a lesson? Let's hurry, Kane. I'll probably come up with something. I think so. If you come up with some way, that would be great, because other than tying him to a chair and leaving him in front of a carrot, I can't think of anything else. Ha ha! Kane, you haven't forgotten how you can transform into me, have you? We can catch Jax red-handed. For instance, you dress up as me and take a bath, splashing around. Meanwhile, Jax will come over the bridge to you and watch. I'll sneak up behind him, scare him, and he'll fall off his own bridge. Yes, Pomni is a very good plan. I can turn into you. Ha ha, now I look like you. So what should I do next? Sit in this bath and wait. Jax should be coming soon, and he'll be watching you. Meanwhile, I'll be watching from the cameras. All right, guys. Let's see if Jax will be spying on us. 
So guys, let's see what's happening on the camera! There's Jax, he's appeared in the frame. He's looking in the window and seems not to be doing anything yet. Where is he moving to? I think guys, he's heading towards the bridge and now he's going to watch me. Look at him! I'm going to turn off the camera and watch him from below! Yes, he's really watching me in the window as I bathe. Let's check another camera. Jax has become so bold. Look at what he's doing! Let's switch to camera! He's looking in the window at me bathing. We must teach him a lesson! All right, guys, let's go up the stairs and teach him. Now I need to scare him. The main thing is to approach unnoticed, so Jack suspects nothing. Let's go, guys. He's looking in the window. I hope he doesn't hear me approaching. I must get up quietly and place the cameras. You need to sneak up on the roof and quietly approach him and scare him so that he has no desire to watch anyone. Jax does not see me and does not turn around. If I do everything quietly, I can scare him. So, now we have to go through this bridge and I will show this Jax what is entertainment. So guys, the main thing is not to scare it. Jax, what are you doing here again? Are you spying on me through the window again? What happened, Pomni? Why, why are there two of you? Why are you in the bathroom here, Pomni? Please don't hit me, Pomni. I didn't do anything wrong. Nothing wrong? You're spying on me again! I told you not to do that! I don't like being watched! Please, please forgive me. I won't do it again, I promise. Please don't punish me! I don't believe you, Jax! Why are you watching Pomni? She told you she doesn't like it when you watch her. I understand everything, but what you did was really wrong. I think you need to apologize and never do it again! Please forgive me, guys. I just like Pomni and I love watching her through the window! You know you can't do that! Why don't you listen to anyone, not even your friend Kane? Okay guys, enough saying I'm bad. I won't do it anymore, I apologized. Why do you keep being mean to me? We're still friends, aren't we? Promise you this won't happen again, I won't watch anymore. Remembering everything? I'm off. Bye everyone, bye! Stop! We're not done with you yet! He ran away, Kane! What do we do with him next? Should we chase him and still teach him a lesson? Ah, I think we can't catch Jax. He runs twice as fast as us. I don't know how to teach him a lesson right now. Today, I really wanted to swim at the beach, and I think we can postpone punishing Jax for later and relax a bit. Today was a very eventful day. Yes, you're right, Kane. Then I guess I'll go home. Take a bath without anyone watching me. Now, I'll go up the stairs and finally take a bath. Oh yes, I've missed a warm bath. I need to relax. It's good that no one will be watching me now. You guys also like to take a hot bath. I always swim in it. Oh yeah, I need to freshen up a bit and then I can go to the beach to swim with Kane and have a great time. Kane is probably waiting for me. The weather is so beautiful outside. Let's look out the window. Yes, indeed, Kane is already swimming and waiting for me. I need to hurry, but first, I need to find some perfume to smell nice and wash my hands. Yes, good. After the bath, I feel better. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Jax, you're so bold. Why are you spying on me again? Why are you hiding behind my wardrobe? I'm going to teach you a lesson now. Running away, you won't get far from me. I'll catch you. You haven't learned your lesson, Jax. Kane. Catch him, Kane! He's running towards you. He was again sitting behind my wardrobe and watching me! You won't catch me. I'll run away. Ha ha! Kane, don't stop me! Oh, so you were watching Pomni again? We told you nobody likes being watched! And you keep doing it. No, Jax. I think you need to think about your behavior. Hey, Jax, stop and stay right there. What? Why should I stop? You'll see for yourself now. What's this? What are you doing? No, don't, don't. Yes, we will. You'll get your carrot. Just try to reach it! Let me out of here, friends. Why? What are you doing? I didn't do anything. That's for getting caught. Well, let him think about his behavior, and meanwhile, we'll go and break the bridge. Guys, we're already up here, and now I'm going to break this bridge. Jax is sitting and thinking about his behavior. I'm breaking the bridge, and it's done. The bridge is broken. Hooray! Jax won't be spying on me anymore. Kane, what shall we do next? Jax has a whole stash of carrots here! Well, I don't know. Jax has some kind of attraction built right out of his house. Maybe we should try his ride. It looks really cool to me, and I think it could be very interesting. Kane, do you think it's a good idea? Yeah, of course. Why not try it out? All right, let's try this attraction. I hope Jax hasn't set any traps on the way. Ha ha! By the way, Kane, do you see that strange black goo over there? 
Yes, it's the trace of Calvmo. It could be very dangerous. We need to tell Jax about it and come check it out together. All right, guys. I think in the next episode, we'll find out what this black spot is. Well, Kane, shall we go? You go first. I'll follow you. Oh, this is so much fun, guys. Oh my god, I love it. Such a great amusement. I really like the high speed. Wow, this is really fun. Good thing Jax put this railway here. I think by the time I check on our friend before we forget about him, he's been sitting there a long time, and maybe it's time to get him out. Jax, trying to escape our trap. Jax, stop. I didn't let you go. Wait, wait. Kane, he's running away. Catch him, Kane. I can't catch him. He runs too fast. Think of something. We can't catch him. Well, he got away, but we'll catch him in the next episode. Yes, we'll catch and punish him in the next episode. This episode is coming to an end. Guys, please like and subscribe to the channel to support us. We really work hard for you and thank you so much for watching. We hope that in the next episode we'll catch Jax and he won't escape from us. Yes, guys, we'll definitely manage it. Ah! Bye-bye.